Good. Very good. Here you go. Oh, this. Oh, this pops. <clears throat> That explains also why this is kind of wobbly a little, you know. It's designed to be. There you go. That's better. Yeah. Let me see if I can fit it back there. Yeah, I feel like. I feel like With comfort! I got that backwards now. But yeah. I mean, who cares if this moves a little, you know? This is not the other planet. We're which is pretty nice. Still, anyway. Yeah. It's actually a, a fairly remarkable amount of space, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Especially when the thing slid out. Where is that to, Dad? That's the, these are the uh, amps. Chargers. Oh, your fuse box. Oh, I thought you it was a, uh, a thing. Yeah. Bacon. How big is this? That's pretty deep, actually. That's, I don't know. I thought it was really small. I'm sure it, it is. How deep, deep it is, too, though. Popcorn for, I mean, again, one or two people. It's not. Did he give you that DVD? Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. I'm going to pay So, it's 30 by. Yeah, just let it in. 30 by 21 by. 30 by 21 by 5. I really like that. Like, Hmm. Oh yeah, these extra trim pieces, isn't these great? They're great now. Have you seen this? I yeah. can give, give you this. Mm. You're going to love this part. So this is the jackknife part, alright? Mm -hmm. You lift it up like this, and then out like that, and bed. these become a bed. Oh, I want to sleep here. Right? That looks pretty comfortable oh to gosh, me. gosh, even the back part. Oh, I'm sleeping on the back part. You like that? Mm -hmm. That one's pretty comfortable. I like it. So that's the jackknife style. Jackknife? Yeah. That? So, oh, you can hop up. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> so. Oh, there we go. We've got some towers here. All right, so then let's lift this back up and look. you got storage space there, too. Oh, sweet. And then you kind of can hold this. Yeah. Oh, Dad, you might want to move. Yeah, right no, there. sometimes it needs to slide it back like that. Hmm. All right, so now we're going to see. Ooh. All right, so now that's the move. Okay, but I honest, <laughs> honestly, honestly, huh? honestly, I mean, I, I thought that you wouldn't even be able to walk. Yeah, no, but you can clearly, you can walk back and forth. I mean, you can't you get back to the yeah. I mean, you can't get back to the bathroom. Just so I mean, know that. But it's only going to be closed when it's either in when storage. You're yeah. yeah, but still, it's remarkably good. Go side and look at it. Yeah. <laughs> And then I, I want to see the awning come out too. I don't know. You probably can't do that much yeah, right though. Here, we, we can put it out just a little bit. Just a little bit anyway. And I'm going to get an outside view of that. Oh, sweet. I can't see it. It's, uh, I think it's gray or grayish okay. green. I'll have to get out and see it. It's still very, very good. I don't know. The other thing that we haven't seen are all these nice lights, too. I mean, there's lights everywhere. So you get to see a lot of stuff up under. Oh, yeah. And this isn't even... Oh, wow! Look at that now! I decided to stop right here. Yeah, yeah. of course. You can see it extends quite... So that extends kind of straight out, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. So that's going to go... That's nice. It smells nice, too. Mm -hmm. And then the operation there is just that button. Yeah, I'll be, uh, uh, behind you. Yeah. So awning in, yep. and it'll actually, you know, extend out and go at a slant nice. as well. So you get that run on. <clears throat> One thing I learned last night is if it's raining, to bring it on in. Yeah. Otherwise, water can pull up on it. Yeah. Well, if it's, I mean, it should have enough slant that it goes off the front. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, 
Well, if you're in an emergency, you can do that and then just put it out and dry it up. And then, then the good thing about this is it's a black one. So, you know, it won't look dirty real fast. You have to look it up. So, this slide out is running on just a battery? Okay. So, this is running on the, the pure 12 volt system then? Nothing to it. Look at that. Oh, look at these steps too. This is nice. I don't think I've even seen this. This stuff is great. Oh, yeah, look at all the room in this. A nice light here. Great. They're really good. And what size bed is this? A standard twin or um, queen bed or? It's called a camper queen. Camper queen. Okay. It's a little bit short. Okay. And these windows open up just fine, right? I mean, they, they open to give you a little ventilation. Yeah, you can open uh, both of these, will crank out the turn. And is that just the bottoms? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you just have the one hand, the one knob there, okay? Yeah, you just gotta turn it so it starts moving. There you go. Yeah, so you just, oh, that's nice. Yeah. Yeah, we can get a nice kind of breeze going through there. Yeah, so when it's raining, see, that's the purpose of that. It's just tilted out. Yeah, nice. Come down that way. That way you're not going to get water inside. Yeah, that's pretty good thinking, actually. And then that's it for closing, right? Just... Mm -hmm. I love kind of the built-in. I love these external... Yeah, box balances. Yeah, nice, just, nice they're real nice touches, yeah. And all the blinds come with it, too. So everything we see with it in here in terms of couch, blinds, and all that, that's all included, right? Correct. Beautiful. It's just I guess it would be shocking if you showed me took all the balance. I know, right? Oh, yeah, you gotta buy the table. <laughs> Couch? You want the cushions in that? Yeah, that's extra. See how we got to the price, though? <laughs> yeah, I do now. <laughs> this is great. And I gotta tell you, the more I've seen this, the more I'm convinced it's the right choice. I'm so excited. Stereo, AM, FM, Bluetooth? Is that uh, right? Yeah, you might have a Bluetooth. Most of them have that. Which <clears throat> is um, crazy. Yep, there it is. There's the Bluetooth mm -hmm. button. So, in the microphone. What would you like to hear as you're heading home? Uh, wow, nice. Sure. Hey, an auxiliary in, too. This already supports Bluetooth right off the bat. So there's nothing to hook up to that. That's nice. This is a standard DIN radio. Mm -hmm. This is a standard DIN size radio. Yeah. So do I have options if I wanted to increase that to a double den or a different stereo? Probably, yeah, you probably could. I think I'll stick with it the way it is for now. Not all too much new at this point. Trying to turn on the link though, but reports powered by speakers. And then we have. I guess there's a button you press for the external speakers or whatever. Plus free shipping and yeah, somewhere in there. For yeah, I'll figure that out. Staples make more happen. So this comes with like an owner's manual with all the. Yeah. Stuff Details and the specifications. Okay. Yep. And if you if you're not nice. using your and you just have it parked, do you suggest keeping it out, the slide out, or keeping it compacted in? Well, if you're not going to use it for a while, I'll just bring it in. Yep. Okay. You know, uh, a lot of people at seasonal campgrounds say you find a place that you would just want to leave it all the time. Yeah. They tend to just leave it out. Yeah. But uh, I'm sure y'all leave y'all's out, right? Because you have people come looking at oh, it yeah. and stuff. Uh -huh. So it doesn't hurt it for no, you to no. stay out. Because you it's have a, a, a bubble squeegee here and an inside squeegee. It kind of seals it up. Okay. Good, yeah. So the you know, critters don't come in and stuff like that. Yeah, we found a, a place today where we're going to park it at. We were going to park it at home, but we have so many trees. And I worry about it. The hot uh, trees just drop stuff. And yeah. it would really mess it up. Plus, trying to turn it around to back it into our yard. It's yeah. just... So we just found a place. This is 29 yeah. feet. Right. This is not the... Shortest thing ever. All right, well, I don't know about y'all, but I'm even more convinced than ever. Well, yeah, right. It's <laughs> <laughs> ours. Well, it's, it's good then to see no, that kind of breakdown there. Let me see. Oh, this is great. 
Yeah. You don't need a you're gonna box need spring, like but you just need a new mattress, right? Need my pillars. Well, yeah, and we need a new mattress. We need a new mattress. Yeah. <coughs> yeah, I love these extra windows too. These are great too. I don't know if you even. Yeah, the, uh, you can order one online and they have a catalog. In so this is called Queen. Yeah. It's a regular Camper Queen. queen. Yeah. Don't have different sizes. I mean, if you have extra space on the sides, just so you have a support here. Yeah. See, you can get a big one. You can order from the top if you want or a memory one. Right. And then underneath this, you also have the storage space yeah. there. One Which is, four. let me look at that. Put all that, I mean, that is a substantial that is nice. amount of storage space. Yeah. I can even hide there. All the luggage goes there, folks. Yeah. Look at that. You got a killer ducted AC vent system right there. Mm -hmm. That's from the bottom. They said, the research I did said that it's very difficult to find that with the ducted, with the ducted systems here. So when you see this, so this is like a real, real nice kind of feature to add on. Yeah, some, uh, some coaches that don't duct them, all your air will drop right here. That's what they were saying, yeah, is you'd yeah, have this thing change. hanging down, <laughs> and that there's two directions then. It goes this way and that way, and that's it, you know. And, but this way it actually dis, you know disperses it, even behind closed doors and stuff too, so very excited. I'm kind of glad that it's not closed off, because it would probably get pretty hot. Well, I guess but you have an AFC vent there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You'll, you'll see a lot of people sometimes will cover this, I mean, if they're sensitive to the cold. Oh, yeah. Especially if you have one close to your head. So this does have a freezer, too. Uh, that's the freezer you're in right now. Okay, but so... But it doesn't have an ice maker. Right. But yeah. if you put in ice cube trays, yeah. it'll make ice. Yeah. And this is just the traditional yeah, refrigerator. Just buy a bag of ice. It's a decent size. Yeah, but I mean, if you just throw it in there and just leave it there, that's nice, too. And then... Storage tank indicators. So that's what these are. Okay. So battery. Okay. And we'll go through all this, I'm sure. Oh, yeah. And there's a water heater that's inside. So this is what the DFI means, the direct fuel right. ignition. You just, means you don't have to go outside for right. it. Right, exactly. You can fire it from there. Because these guys hooked up to a battery right now can do that. So that's nice. Yeah, we read about what... I mean, there are lights. Guys, I mean, there are lights everywhere. What kind of replacement lights do these take? Uh, there's a little number bulb on there. Okay. I think it's just like your regular auto. But I mean, guys, there are lights and... all throughout. So you don't have to worry about having a lamp and... No, that's what I'm saying. I mean, I don't even think... Enough overhead lighting. Who's that? I guess I just need a bulb. Maybe some bulb there. Or maybe it's just a light switch. Oh, that's... Yeah, that is their thing. I think it's a light switch. It's actually possible. Is that a light switch? Yeah. Oh, that's ah. what it was. Yeah. <laughs> but this is great because, I mean, this way you can sort of have more soft lights. Mm -hmm. Now, this is a 30-watt system. This is not the 50. Okay. But well, most of the campgrounds have at least everyone's 30. Got th everyone's got 30. Yeah. Right. Few have 50. All, Some... tra all the trailers are all 30. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. The only thing time you get in the 50 is, is, is in yeah, the huge okay. fifth wheels with the two air conditioners and the motor wheels. Okay. And that's the only reason why you need 50 is you have those two air yeah, conditioners. Two air conditioners. So, so I can, like if I buy a blender, I can run my blender and she can blow dry her hair at the same time and mm -hmm. there's no problem. Right. Okay. Or I have a toaster or something like the that. The bottom line is we can leave the AC on while you use the microwave. Exactly. Okay. okay. Well, that's fine. That'll work perfectly. Um, do the cables come with that or is that something I have to buy when I hook up? The hoses. Uh, the hoses. Yeah, hoses, the hoses and power cable, I guess. Is... Uh, the cable should be built in. Let's take a look. Yeah, let's go look at that then. All right, um, I need a pen. Do you guys have a pen? No, I don't have I need to write down. I need to write down the dimensions of the TV. Well, you have a... I do that. You're right. Can I do this, guys? Nice power outlet right oh, here. Because remember, the thing is going to be out over here, right over our head. So it's nice having a power outlet here. This is, I think, is our, our heater. We have a 25-foot plug here. Oh, good. All right, so let's look at that real quick. Okay. Let's pull this all the way out. So it's a 25-foot, mm -hmm. 30. 30 amp. And does it go back in? or how do Yeah, you then you just, just push it back Feed in. it back in. This is a hot and cold shower, so you can. Uh, so it's an external shower. This is one of the add-on features. This is an external shower. This deal right here. Uh huh. So if you're at the beach. Yeah, you can rinse off. Before you walk in and get the inside there, yeah. See, not a lot of people will wash the dishes. You know. Why not, right? <laughs> yeah, I mean, and we've also got the we've also got the backup tire here, the replacement tire. We'll set up one of those. Um, Privacy tent things. If you have guests and stuff like that, they can take a shower outside. Oh, okay. Now this whole area underneath here. Mm -hmm. Actually, what, what is this? 
That's a, a cable. Oh, cable. Oh, so that's where the cable TV would be uh, plugged into. Okay. But this, from this perspective, I mean, this is all fortified. There's nothing special I have to do in terms of kind of keeping this braced or anything. No, it's a, I haven't seen any um, um, issues come in through the service with that. Okay. Yeah, only if you catch something on it. That would be yeah. bad. And I see that there is a manual way to solve it if for some reason the motor's not working. Exactly, yeah. And they'll show you how to do We'll go through well. that and then part of that there too. And these are the stabilizer jacks. There's four right, of these? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Four of these. Okay. A lot of people what to do is get a, a small a cordless drill with a nut bolt and just go like this. It comes down pretty quick. Yeah. And, and these are our tank down. hookups here. Gray and black. Right. It'll right. be yeah, here. Let's just see where those hook up. Okay. And then your, these represent your uh, nine bolts, which are right. Do what pulls? Right here. This is your uh, pull. See, so what happens if you're using your tanks, you keep this closed. Okay. If you hook up to the campground, you pull them open. Ah. Uh, okay. So that's the black. Okay. And this is the gray. There's the gray right, right. there. Okay, so if they're out, they're closed, and if, in, they're no, open. If they're out, they're draining. Okay. If they're closed, if you're they're in, they're in closed. Yeah, they're in your tanks. And okay. Then they just have a dump uh -huh. So you can take, help me understand, this is a simple question, but. <clears throat> This one has three tanks, which means that we fill it up with fresh water. Uh -huh. And then, so there's a certain amount of water that comes, that we could fill up in that tank without being plugged in, that we could use, right? So right, if we had right. 40 gallons of fresh water uh -huh. on board, we can use yeah, those 40 gallons. you can actually gallons. take a shower without being hooked up. Okay, but that's kind of where I was know, going at. Don't take like a, you know, all day shower. Long shower, because there's 40 <laughs> gallons or whatever. Yeah. Same holds true with the gray and the black tank. We can use those to the point that they're full. Right. When they're full, you got to absolutely find a place to dump them. But absolutely. otherwise, right. it's not like you have to be hooked up constantly. No, right. Okay, cool. Very cool. And then when you pull that indicator on the wall, yeah. it starts showing you how high you're getting. <clears throat> Okay, so this is fresh water in. Right, so that will fill your tank up okay. inside. And then this is city water connection help. Right. This is so what happens is you'll have your white hose rise, okay. that you may be storing in here or whatever, and then you put that to the campground for direct water. Okay. And then pressurize it. So it's more pressurized, so that yeah. regulates the water versus mm -hmm. this, which is. So this is your, your fresh water tank. If you don't have this, at least you have water in the unit to take a shower with. Okay. And where okay. do we get the power? Water? Yeah, you can. Water well, if you're going to travel far away, maybe put a third of it in there so you can, if you have to go use the bathroom. Yeah, you've got that ability. Okay. okay. And by then, when you get closer, then fill it up so you're not hauling okay. around all that weight. Yeah. The battery in this is stored where? Uh, we'll put a battery right here. Okay. In this tray. It'll live, this is the tray here uh -huh. then. Okay, so a new battery will go there. Correct. Got it. Got it. And then we'll this. fill these tanks and he'll go over this how you. Okay. Uh, how you actually what you do, and he'll tell you, is you turn both of them on, this regulates it. Oh, nice. So when one uh, goes out, the other will go out, and then it'll tell you you got one down. You don't so what will that power for me? That power is, I mean, see the water heater, in your, stove. In your uh, refrigerator. Okay. So it can run the refrigerator off of that, too? Yes. So, so if, if you, you don't, don't have, have electricity? Electric, yeah, it'll, it'll run on this. How many hours would you say you get off of? Maybe all week. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Just so it depends on how much time you keep opening it up, you know? Yeah, absolutely. But it's substantial. Okay, yeah. that's impressive. I mean, that's why they had the two then. Okay. Right. And this is the pass through luggage. These are just clips. This is good stuff. I definitely want to get a quote on the handle, and I definitely want to get a, um, a uh, quick look at some of those brackets that we talked about for the TV. What I'm going to do, uh, probably I'll have to call you tomorrow. I'm a, a yeah. service advisor. Yeah. Come out and take a look at the unit. Yeah, suggestions and then go ahead and put that.